Oh yeah, I forgot to redo the raids. Because we, uh... We did the heist, and then I sort of just forgot. So, let's go for... People-wise, I think we're doing just fine. Let's just go for stuff to sell, I guess. Although, looting up some uranium... It's not like we can stockpile uranium, though. It just goes straight to selling. Um... Coal, logs, pineapple. I mean, that's that's a pretty good one. We use all of that a bit. So we can just go for that. They've accumulated so many raid points. <laughs> okay, they instantly leave. That's nice. Still working on the parking decks. I think I'd like to get tourism up going at some point soon-ish also. Because I think we... I think we kind of can. Get like, uh... Uh... I don't really know if I could do much of a tourist island here. Because generally the Brandenburg Gate boosting tourism and all that, this sort of turned into a, a tourism hotspot of sorts. Hmm. Right. It's not that expensive to get going. I think I might do that, though. That might be the next thing. Sort of working on nuclear and then also getting a bit of tourism going at some point. And the a broker, because I am doing canned up. goods. Nothing illegal. Well, nothing. You don't have the cost anymore. Yeah, yeah, you do. Okay, that's the one. 1,000 canned goods. Yeah, just keep it on that. It's fine. The more the better. Hmm. We are getting a lot of hides in. Pollution's doubled. Upkeep is doubled. I don't know. Let's go for, uh... Just give him a little more money, I guess. It's only 10%. Mmm... I don't know. I'm not sure. I mean, should I just get, like, another tannery? Maybe two? Could do that. Could do that. And then another Teamster office might be kind of a cool thing at some point. We've got the one here. One there, one over here, although you're sort of busy with all of this business. Um, you never actually connected to the road, it seems. Annoyingly. Okay. There we go. So you're doing the uranium. Okay. 16,000 for the blueprint. Wow. And how much I actually built the thing? 32,000? Damn. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We got the fire station, though, really nearby. So far, they've been doing a really good job with the fires. Pretty happy about that. We keep getting these flashes for power outages. Which I think... I think that's just them being full of it. I think we are fine. <laughs> I think we're doing okay. I have a bunch of trade route offers available. So let's go for some exports of... Sugars plus 10%. To the smugglers? Alright, maybe. I still have sugar up, right? 
You can't make lemonade without a plantation and a good supply of migrant workers. <laughs> a simple man from simpler times. But he had a point and a gun. And so do you, Presidente. Let's squeeze some lemons. Have you heard this fossil? <laughs> he still thinks the proletariat is a commodity to buy and sell like chicken wings. Tropico's workers have been squeezed enough. Help them, Presidente. Garbage dump or a childhood museum? I feel like I need both of them, but for now, let's go with... Communists? We'll do that. And excess electricity, 25%. Increase it to 25. Get out of here. I don't care. It doesn't give a reward. It's just like a tutorial guide. Well, not tutorial, but just a general guide thing. More broke people. Ugh, I probably need another 10 to or 12. <laughs> That's the constant supply of people. An immigration office would be a great thing. Um, That was infrastructure. No. Oh, yeah. Oh, I already have it. Building's unique. <laughs> Decreases it by 80% on base efficiency. Allows everyone increasing by 50% on base. Ooh. Maybe. Hmm. Let's drop that down a lot. Just relax with the immigration for a moment. Right, trade. Um, sugar was the thing that I've got going on. I got that already. And you're also what pineapple. Do We're doing multiculture here, so hopefully the efficiency from fertility stays as is. Because of the work mode, it's decreased a lot, right? I can throw a little more money at you and go with... And nearby plantations and hydroponic plantations. That's just a modern age thing, I think. By 10%. I mean, why not, right? There you go. Cool. And you're still mon uh, monoculture and efficiency is just fine. The fertility is not being affected here at all. <laughs> okay, but we could export some sugar. Um... That is a thing we can do. It's 10%. Go for the bigger one. Okay. Export a bit of meat. Sure. Well, let's leave it at that for now. Uh, you can't want to duke it out with us. We're the good guys. That's why we have the most nukes. Well, not nuke you, of course. You're too close to our borders for that option. But I have thousands of dossiers describing my non-nuclear options, so make the right choice. Uh, import from them. Or blockade. Delays trade by three months. Eh. Eh. Yeah, alright, fine. And that's, that's these guys, right? Western powers, yeah. You have exactly one, and you're not charging any extra for it. Okay, sure. I'll take some milk. I guess. But whatever. We all know that El 
El Presidente hates bullies. So when superpowers try to bully Tropico, Presidente says, no more trade for you. You would think. Okay, yeah, we got a lot of vacant homes for poor people. And a lot of homeless poor people. Also some more broke people. <sighs> okay. Um... Sure. We can do that. Not many people living in there, though. Requires poor or higher. Just start ripping apart some of these, uh... Shacks, then, I guess. Again. Why are you complaining about the road? I'm so glad I made this. There's canned goods. Presented. That happened pretty quickly. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, okay. They, they get a lot of stuff. And yeah, if you have a trade route or anything like that, it prefers that over local consumption. Cool. Okay. Let's go for... Air quality for 20. Oh, that's one that deteriorates, though. That's well off or better, an apartment. Yeah, we're... Sort of at our limit here with all that. I do that there. I can't really squeeze another one anywhere else, so. Yeah, fine. Build that there. And let's go for another tenement down here, even though that first one's like not being used, but oh well. And that way we've got it. Actually. Start to do apartment, I can squeeze two in. Yeah, let's do that. There we go. Okay, that should be plenty for the housing for a little while. The only thing is I have to destroy the shacks that they put up. And I guess I just put them up, like, near their workplace if they can. I'm not really entirely sure how it determines that. Let's go for that to decrease its fire, because it's pretty far off. Does it have access to electricity? It does. Only just. Okay. Have a power drill. And I will sit for a moment and wait for the money to stockpile a little bit before going for the uh, reactor. The citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. It seems that they want the choice in how they um, are So selfish. I mean, we're, I'll deliver a speech, sure. I, why not? I'll acknowledge the faith happiness to boot them out. But you can see the, what few people there are. They're pretty happy. There's not many of them, I think. I will praise the industrialists, I guess. Blame the Western powers and promise improvement on... Maybe nothing. Just ignore that, I guess.
I'm trying to think of what would be the easiest to improve and maybe job happiness, but that'd be expensive. Well, ugh, I probably shouldn't do a speech at all, honestly, but we'll go for that. My friends, my people, welcome to a golden age of prosperity for every living Tropican. It was your trust that made it possible. Your trust of me, El Presidente. Other nations look to Tropico with a barely concealed jealousy. That is fully warranted. We have all the best landmarks, and they keep carelessly losing theirs. Your Presidente does not ignore your faith. You need places to pray, to confess your sins, and to nap before Holy Communion. God is everywhere, but it is unwise to worship outside in hurricane season. Without a doubt, Tropico must grow. We owe so much of our prosperity to the industrialists. They create jobs and commerce and take only a little in return. My people, do not talk of the so-called Western powers. They are paranoid fools who accuse others of spying. Their own spies shall retreat with red faces. So vote El Presidente for the future that you deserve. All of you, Viva Tropico! Does the green just mean I can put it there? So we're up to 91 approval rating, which is actually pretty insane. <laughs> That's very, very good. I'll throw it there. Ugh. Road, please curve a decent way. There, that works. Do that. Appearance matters, and this is sort of hidden off to the side a little bit. Should be okay pollution-wise and all that. I don't know. We'll see. And it's like right there for the uranium mine. And I'll go ahead and build another Teamster office over here, too. From production to processing buildings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll throw you here. Okay, and the road, I can still weave it through. That's still possible. So I can uh, keep expanding out to over here or so, which I could totally make just a new tourism area, I suppose. I'm not sure. Because the tourism dock. Tourist port. It's a bit expensive. That's that's the most expensive part of it, though, because like giving them a hotel and stuff isn't not really a problem. Well off or rich will arrive. Well off or better, rich or better. Okay, okay. But yeah, why not? Let's do some parks and stuff. Jeez, can't believe I don't have any. And squeeze a couple in here. Oh yeah, that spot was blocked. That's okay. Uh, I think I can squeeze a couple really small ones in. Periodically here. Hey. Hey, I see you there. Unbelievable. <laughs> can fit another here. Sort of periodically dot them throughout, you know. Cool. 
What's your issue? Empty stock. You're not getting in any logs. Well. Uh, clearly I pay you too much then. You just gotta help me make the world a better place for the trees and the little critters of nature. You just can't turn Tropico into a wasteland full of factories spewing toxic death. Really, little lady. You must try to be less fanciful. Spew toxic death? <laughs> I'd look at what your protesters are smoking behind those barricades. Cigar, Presidente? And maybe some business? Those are both not that easy to do. Um, I think I kind of have to decline this one. Mandatory Waste Sorting Edict. Did I start with that? No, I have to research it still. And our research is very slowly going. No income on it. What's going on with that? Easy upgrade. We're like, God damn, come on. Maybe I could build another library. Your genius is undeniable, President, but would you, you stop it? An I Quit it. Fulfill the trade route. Sure, we're doing that again. Or is that this still? I think that's the same one. And they're wanting me to fulfill the export trade, which I've also got going. That's going to be a little while. I feel like none of the meat's going out to the dock. Don't know about that. But I can pick up another one. That, that's fine. If there's anything nice out there. Like canned goods. I mean, shit, sure, look at that. I'll take that. Well, never mind then. Okay, fine. I, I ignored that for a moment then. Guess I can praise you, sure. Broker. Do any of these offers look good to you? They're all strictly legitimate. Hmm. Would otherwise cost 2,375. Sure. And then money I need to keep an eye on. I don't know what's happening with it. What have I done? Instruction. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's... Yep. That's no absolutely a thing. Being a spy is voting against El Presidente in an election. Do not make this fatal mistake. You bought us some time, Presidente. I'm not sure how much or what it cost. And for God's sake, don't tell me! Random blueprint, please. Because some of these are really expensive. TV station. Okay. 
Expel the Eastern Bloc from the Embassy. Hmm. Hmm. Would I be able to uh, bring them back afterwards? Thanks you. You're it's like a thousand dollars. Okay, and that timed out. Yeah, that's that's fine. Security checkpoint finished up because of that. So I can set you to road toll and you to road toll. I don't know if this is an effective road toll or not. I'm not sure. Do not know. We're researching that now. Uh huh. We have the blueprint for a TV station. Oh yeah, that was four thousand one hundred. That's that's getting to be worth it. Oh yeah, the inspiring billboard increases approval of just people driving by. <laughs> Let's get a bunch of propaganda going. Okay. Let's just let's just sit for a moment and see what happens here with the money. Here's twenty one thousand from the freighter. Are we overall profitable? Hmm, reds. The coal from the raids alone might be enough to keep the power plant going, I'm not sure. And power plant, is that done? It is. How much do you... Basic settings, I can switch it over to uranium enrichment if I research it. Power output decreased by 50. Upkeep is reduced by 20 on medium budget. Bonus can be accumulated. Bomb production rate of the nuclear program increased by 20% on medium budget. Can be accumulated up to 60. Okay. Increased capacity of uranium and job quality improved with lead, lead shielding. Okay. This is connected to grid 1, of which we have 812 spare power. So, uh... Yeah. We can, uh, we, we can, we can cut some funding, I think. Yeah, that affects job quality, but, uh, that's fine. Wow. I can probably actually just, like, shut this down. Honestly. I'll keep it running as a backup, just in case something happens with the uranium mining, but, uh, oof. Oof, we got power. <laughs> Was there a time limit on that? No. Okay. I'm sure the good citizens of Tropico no. intend to vote. Oh freely, we got this. Very easily we have that. Fill the import route. Okay, fine. Port cars. That's fifty percent. Fuck that. Import planks. Easy. Tropico has ceased trading with a certain major superpower. The palace's statement. They don't trade fair, so neither will we. The election is a landslide, Presidente. Oh, the yeah. metaphorical kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. I think this is all fine.
Yeah, I don't think I'm changing any of that. That is all okay. We all know that El Presidente hates bullies. So when superpowers try to bully Tropico, Presidente says, no more trade for you. Okay. We are still exporting the sugar and meat, but we finished up the canned goods once. Let's see if we can get maybe another one going. Plus 5%. Yeah, I'll take it. Go for the big one. We export a lot of canned goods, I'm pretty sure. Money wise, we are making money. We are making money. Rum distillery running out. Yeah, because we're exporting the sugar, I think, right now. That is okay. And you can be refit for a Teamster port. Okay. We up. Uh, research the tourist port uh. and you can be refit to become the tourist port 